And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout. Last time we talked to the leader of the uh, Blades, to Razor. Um, and we learned that the regulators... Um, well, that the situation appears not to be as it was um, claimed by Zimmerman and the regulators. So the, the Blades, after all, do, don't seem to be the villains in this town, and... The gang, the, well, the gang leader, in quotes, actually, she, she well, Razor, refused the notion that the, the Blades would be a gang. Um, and then we, well, went to Zimmerman and basically told him that we are, we are not going to kill Razor, the gang leader of the, well, the leader of the Blades, and then basically the whole town, at least all the regulators, attacked us. And then Dogmeat died in this combat, and then I decided to reload, so this didn't happen. Okay. Now we've entered this part of the L.A. Boneyard, and there's a huge library, and we should try to find out what's going on here. We see a slender young woman with a smudged face and dark clothing. You're not from around here. Who are you? Hmm. Name's Mr. Man. And what, may I ask, are you doing in L.A. Boneyard? First tell me who you are. All right, fair enough. I'm called Katya. What's it matter to you? I'm looking for information. Can you help? Hmm, maybe. You definitely aren't one of those gang and shift shavers, shift shovers. What do you want? I need more information about L.A. Boneyard. What can you tell me about the Blades? I've dealt with them before. They're not too bad as far as gangs go. They have a hideout in an old club with some outposts. If you're careful, you might even be able to get some of them to talk. What can you tell me about the Gunrunners? The Gunrunners used to be a real gang, but they went soft. They started setting up a deal with when, where, where they trade weapons that they get from the victims or buy from the hub. Since nobody here is up for the trip to the hub personally, they do pretty good business even though their prices are high. What can you tell me about the followers? The followers of the Apocalypse are a group of peace preachers who live in a large library near the heart of L.A. Boneyard. Why they haven't been wiped out yet, I can't say. They are lousy combatants and have no understanding of the real world, but other than that, they are polite and well-educated. What can you tell me about Aditum? Aditum is my original home. A little too boring for me, though. It's a fenced-off and self-sufficient town in the south end of El Aboniat, but not as far as the cathedral. We trade sometimes with the hub. Um, I need to know about the area around the city. El Aboniat is a pretty hostile place. I've never had the opportunity to leave, though I suppose I'd take it. Let's see. Just south of here you have the cathedral. There's some sort of cult there, but I stay away from them. I don't plan to stay in this place too much longer myself. No kidding. If you're looking for another hand, I'll sign on. Better than spending the rest of my existence in this hell, all right? You're a welcome addition, but the desert's not much fun. All right. Looks like we've got a little ass licking to do. Um, I suppose you mean this in a metaphorical sense? Or do you actually want to lick my asshole? Anyway, no, we've now Katya in our party. Let us ask her what combat skills she has. I learned how to be a scrapper for my time in L.A. Boneyard. I'm good with knives and submachine guns. My favorite is throwing knives, of course. Uh, okay. We have some knives. I 
Well, but we don't have... I don't think we have throwing knives. Do we have some submachine guns? No, of course. You probably want to have some stim packs, however, um, we should give you a submachine gun. Maybe there's one in... Uh, somewhat inventory. Okay, you don't have a submachine gun. Hmm. And you do not either, okay. Um, we should at one point try to give you a submachine gun then. For in the meantime, we shall just... Um, and we are... Okay, I'm at my maximum. Oh, because I bought all this plastic explosives, okay. Um, hello, Tisho. Why won't you have the why don't you have this plastic explosives? You douche. Okay. Yeah, that's a good trade, you idiot. I really hate Ian. I mean not Ian, I, I tissue. I, I wish he would die. But then again, if he dies I will probably just reload because. Yeah, that's, that's just how I am. Okay, um, there doesn't appear to be much in these bookshelves, um, except books. Yes, okay. There's some... There's a person. A studious follower of the apocalypse. That we can't talk to, okay. There's a locker. Containing nothing at all. There's a... Desk containing nothing at all. There's a ice chest containing knives. Okay. Well, I suppose we could steal a knife and then give it to her. Greetings. Blah! Hey, we're very glad you could join us. We hope you have found our humble abode to your satisfaction. And that is actually not uh, Katya, but someone else. Thanks. Uh, can you tell me? Okay. Can you tell me more about what you worship here? We don't worship so much as follow a set of principles. We want to bring peace back to this wasteland. The world tends toward destruction, so we try to make a difference. Hmm. And how do you do this? We try to remind people why the Great War happened in the first place and help ensure it won't ever happen again. Okay, this is... This sounds reasonable, I guess, but... How successful are you exactly? We never give up hope. We never will, even though most live by the gun these days. Hmm. And we are concerned with the children of the cathedral. Why are you concerned with them? They claim to want peace like us, but anyone who disagrees with them just disappears. Hmm. Their dark god is not what he seems, believe me. Hmm. How do you know this? Call it instinct. We've seen Morpheus and the Nightkin, and they don't look like peacemakers to us. Their hospitals and message of peace make them attractive, but we know there's evil there. So, you don't really know, you just have a, a feeling, is what I take from this. Or do you have any clues? Hmm. A number of our spies have seen Nightkin coming in and out of the back room of the children's temple. Something important is back there. Hmm. Can I ask you a few more ask, questions? and I'll answer if I can. Um, can you tell me a little bit about the history of the followers? What would you like to know? When did it start? Far to the south, near the Great Glow. The times were hard, but we managed to survive. We realized then the Great War must never happen again. Hmm. Why did you go to the north? There aren't many left down south. The radiation polluted almost everything. Most of the remaining people followed us to start the organization. Hmm. 
How did your family survive? We lived on the outskirts of the Great Glow. Sickness had started spreading, so we gathered all the people and we made our way north. <sighs> That's when my parents were killed. Hmm. I'm sorry. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now, is there anything else you needed to ask me? Hmm. Yes, there is. Ask, and I'll answer if I can. Um. What would you like to know? Who started it? After my parents were killed by marauders. <sighs> it was time the killing stopped. It's our goal to make this land the way it used to be, before the war. Who were the marauders? We've never found out. Although we've heard a group live up north in an old ruined city. We've let it rest. Hmm. I wonder what that refers to. So we should probably check the map. Um, hmm. Why not? You could could have, you could get revenge. We're here to make peace, not kill in hatred. Hmm. Yeah, it's very noble. There it, aren't many left hmm. down south. The radiation polluted almost everything. Most of the remaining people followed us to start the organization. It's still that radioactive after 80 years? Well, the rumor is that there was something so important there that the area was saturated with bombs to ensure everything was wiped out. Hmm. Probably the FE virus. Can I ask you a few more questions? Ask, and I'll answer if I can. What do you worship? We don't worship so much okay, as um, followers. We try to remind people why the Great War, yeah. we never give up hope. We never will. They claim to want peace like us. Mm. But anyone who disagrees with them just disappears. Their dark god is not what he seems. Believe okay, me. Is it, is it this what all the followers think or just you? We are united. If not, we'll perish. Now forgive me if that irritates you. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to upset you. Is there anything else you need to know? Uh, Ask, and I'll answer if I what can. What else do you know about the children of the cathedral? You've probably seen their hospitals around. They preach peace, but there is something very wrong with them. We need to find out what. Can I ask you a few more questions about them? Ask, and I'll answer if I can. Do you know who their leader is? Morpheus is the leader of the children of the cathedral. He is evil, and that fact must be exposed. Hmm. Do we have any suspicions about them? A number of our spies have seen Nightkin coming in and out of the back room of the children's temple. Something important is back there. Hmm. Can you help me destroy them? No, but I know someone who will. Go to the cathedral and find a woman named Laura. Say the phrase Red Rider. We'll create a diversion if we can. Thanks. I can use all the help, help I can Our get. Our destiny lies before us. Let us hope we are worthy. Okay. Do we have a quest now that says that... Um... Hmm. Okay, this is not, it's not marked as a quest, but... When we get to the cathedral, we should try to find this person named Laura. And this person we just talked to was actually Nicole. Um, a very noble person. At least in part. Um, that they not, not took revenge. Um, yeah, and I'm talking about nobility and then I'm just going to steal these stim packs. Um, anyway, uh, yes, it's a very, very noble of them not to take revenge, I guess. And I steal these stim packs too, because I can. Okay, so. Uh, we should probably go to the children of, to the cathedral of the children of to the cathedral of the children of the cathedral and try to find out what's in the back room of uh, this cathedral and yeah try to verify or um debunk 
the, suspic the suspicion that Nicole has about them. Um, but this will have to wait until next time. Yes, so when we come back, folks, we'll probably visit the children of the cathedral. Or maybe we'll go and defeat the death claws and get go to the gun runners. In any case, so until next time, folks, um, till then.